what's good, Kale's His Family? As usual, if you are new, please subscribe, like, and leave a comment. If you are returning, welcome back. We're here today for another official video. We got game three of the Eastern Conference Finals between the Indiana Pacers and the Boston Celtics. The line here starts at minus seven and a half, and the over under here is set at 222 and a half. We are here in Indiana for this one, man. And I knew, I knew game two was gonna be a blowout. I told you guys game two was gonna be a blowout. You know? And the Pacers, they came out and shocked the world in game one by sending it to overtime and almost winning game one. But I knew a locked in Jalen Brown and a locked in Jason Tatum and the rest of the group would come and be ready to play in game two. Now, honestly, I don't think that Jason Tatum has showed up yet. And I think Jalen Brown is ascending to be to show why he is the best player right now on the team and during this playoff run. Now, Jason Tatum, I still do feel will give the slight edge as the better player, and it's going to show up sooner or later. But as of right now, he has not, and Jalen Brown has taken over the team. Now, we are here in Indiana in this one, and this crowd is going to be rocking. Indiana has played very well at home, but I don't personally feel as if they're going to win a game. Yes, as I've said in the video one and video two, game one and game two, I don't think this is going to be an a, a easy easy road for Indiana at all, or if you want to make it an easy road, make it a harder road for Boston, you know, you might get at least a game at home. I don't think it's even going to be a gentleman's sweep and it'd be done in five. No, I think this is going to be a sweep. And I believe this is, this is why this video is going to be short sweep because I am all in on Boston. Like I have been game one and game two. Now they did shock us and they didn't cover the spread game one. They did cover the spread game two, like I called. And here in game three, I believe it's going to be in a, well, first of all, Boston has not been playing as great as defense as I thought that they should. And they do show about playing defense on the road, which is why I see why this over under here is set as high as it is. I believe Indiana is going to get up and down the court. They're going to score a lot of points and they're going to play as best as they can here at home in front of their home crowd. But as far as winning, no. I would still take Boston on the money line and I'm going to take Boston's spread here. You know, give me Boston minus seven and a half here. And that's my free play for the day. Again, if you are new here, please subscribe, like, leave a comment of your choice. If you are returning, thank you again for watching. Let's keep growing.